For me, a movie is only made better by an incredible car. In fact, sometimes the car becomes more memorable than the film itself, especially when that car is being driven by one of the most popular characters in film history. We're obviously talking about 007. Well, I'm on the perfect road in the perfect car with the perfect riding companion. And who better to talk about James Bond than James Bond's stunt driver and friend of the show, Ben Collins. He's really quite a proper English gentleman. In fact, people call James Bond the poor man's Ben Collins. This is the latest thing from Lotus, the Evora 400 Sport. This is like the latest evolution from the Evora right. S, but it's a vastly different car. So two thirds of the car is, is new. It's got twice the downforce. It's got 50 more horsepower. So this thing's got some serious pepper. Lotus was founded in 1952 by Colin Chapman in Norfolk, England. They're known for building lightweight, excellent handling sports cars, and they also have a very successful racing branch. Yet surprisingly, they've been near bankruptcy several times, but that hasn't stopped them from producing some of the most beautiful sports cars, including the Esprit, which of course was featured in the 1977 Bond film, The Spy Who Loved Me. It's interesting how Lotus got into the film. Apparently, every manufacturer, by the time Roger Moore got involved, and they all wanted their their cars to be in the film. Yeah, the product placement. And apparently Lotus was a small firm with not a lot of influence. And they took their new Esprit and they would drive it to the movie set and park it somewhere near the set where the producer, Cubby Broccoli, could see it. And then finally one day, Cubby said, what does that car look like a spaceship? Let's put that in the movie. That's what I heard. And apparently yeah. whenever he'd come out to inquire about it, they just drive off and um, sort of leave some dust. Oh, that's fine. And uh, come back eventually, they said, look, we've got to have that car in the film. It looks amazing. What is it? It's a Lotus. And that's how yeah. I made it in. And this car is sort of the grandson or successor to perhaps the Lotus Esprit, would Something you say? Something like that. It's got that same ethos because it's a really raw machine. Yeah. It's, uh, it's very drivable. Um, and, uh, well, and his wife, which obviously matches the Spy Love Me. Right, but, right. But the key thing to it is that, that level of performance. And I think the Esprit in the day was the, the supreme sports car of its time. The Spy Who Loved Me, that was probably came out in the 70s, I yep. think. So you were probably, what, about two when yep. that came out? I, I don't remember, remember it yeah. then, but I watched it later. Now, I remember seeing it in the theater. It, it was pretty amazing. You remember the helicopter coming up over the top? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And it, it was very cheeky. Remember, it had all those sort of flirtatious Bond things. There was a pretty girl flying the heli. It was kind of a relentless chase. Yeah. A classic car chase. I remember it now. <laughs> So it's fun to drive basically the successor to that car. Yeah. Oh, I'd love to try it myself, actually. Would it be possible to maybe take it for a spin on the way down the hill? Oh, well, I guess not. You know, I'm having fun doing this. I know but you are. I guess you're the guest, and it's and you are the stunt driver. And I'm, I've been watching you silently criticizing me. So, all right, let's see how you do. I'm going to pull over here, and we'll let you get behind the wheel. You're a very kind man. Thank you. My turn? Your turn. Great. You gonna hop in? Uh, I've got something to do. Okay. Good day, Mr. Collins. Strange. I get the feeling that Jay doesn't like me very much. Now, 
I've got you, Collins. <laughs> Ben has always been a good sport when he comes on the show, even when I'm trying to kill him. <laughs> hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you'll find videos from all your favorite CNBC shows. Be sure to subscribe by clicking right here. Click on the videos around me and watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.